You are welcome to today's class. Today's class is on language team. Let's look. In the olden days, before the invention of computer and some other things, we do a lot of calculation on our own, even without the use of computer. We do all these minor mathematics on our own without the use of computer. And with time, we could even do some calculation without using calculator. Why there are some that will make use of calculator, but not using it directly. Like for instance, when you see 2 times 4, and you quickly press it on your calculator, 2 multiplied by 4, bam, 8. No. We may use calculator, but not immediately like that. That's 2 times 4, then you press 2 times 4, and it give you 8. There is a way we can solve using log. Now, we want to look at example 1. Example 1 says, Example 1 says that evaluate for 632.71 times 251.07 using load solution. Now we say log 4632.71 equals to and log 251.07 equals to this. Let us look for the log of both. Then you can use your calculator or your four figure table. We now say log, using calculator, you see log 4632.71, which will give you 3.665835. 115. That is for log 4632.71. Now, log 251.07, log 254.51.07. That will give you 2.3997. 2.399794823. After getting this, you can now say that log 10 raised to power, what is it? 3.665835115. Then we have multiplication sign here. The multiplication sign, according to the law of indices, then will become positive plus 2 point, this one, 399794823, which will now equals to 10 raised to power. This plus this, what will it give us? 2.999, this plus this. Plus 3.66 5 8 3.6658 3 5 1 1 5 equals to 6.0 is equal 6 5 is equal 6 5 6 2 9 6 2 9 9 3 8 which our final answer will now give us 10 raised to power this will be our final answer. We now say 10 raised to power 6 point is equal 6, 5, 6, 6, 2, 5, 6, 6, 2, 5, 6, 6, 2, 
Oh, sorry. Is zero six five six two nine nine three eight. Our final answer will give us one thousand one six. So that will be one million one hundred and sixty three thousand one hundred and thirty four point five zero one. This is our final answer. We move to example two. In example two, we say solve. log 10 raised to power 2.5 divided by log 10 raised to power 1.5. Now we say solution log 10 log 10 raised to power 2.5. This 2.5, the division sign is there. We change it to minus, minus 1.5. Log 10, log 10 is in common. We have log 10, 2.5 minus this. We should now give us log 10 equals 2.5 minus 1.5, 1. Which our final answer will go 10 raised to power 1, 10. Using calculator to divide it directly by saying bracket open 10 raised to power 2.5 divided by 10 raised to power 1.5. You will have 10 as your final answer. Example 3. In example 3, calculate, calculate 1,242.67 raised to power 6, 1, 2, 4, 2, 6, 7 raised to power 6 using logs. Now, calculate this using log. What is the solution to this? We say solution. In this solution, calculate 1, 2, 4, 2.6, 7 raised to the power 6 using log. We now bring this down out, saying log 1, 2, 4, 2.6, 7 raised to the power 6. Which you give or equals to the six we come here, six log one two four two point six seven. Then we move on with our solving. Coming here with our solving, we now say six in bracket. What is log 1242.67? We come here, says log 1242.67, which will give us 3.09435581. 1. Four. Multiplying this, what do we have? Times six. That will now be six multiplied by three point zero nine four three five five eight one four, which equals to eighteen point five six six one three four eight eight. Now to get our final answer, we now say. Therefore, our answer, therefore, answer, or you just say that the 10, 10 raised to power this answer we have gotten, which is 18.566134888. Now, our final answer equals to 10 raised to power that. Then raised to power eighteen point five six six one three four eight eight equals to three six eight two four three six eight 
2, 4 equals to 3, 6, 8, 2, 4. So, so, this is our final answer. 10 raised to the power this will give us this. Now, example 4. Example 4 say use log to use log to find to find its root of 2 2 6.34. Now, want to use log to find the eighth root of this. How do we use log to find the eighth root of this? We say solution. This is log eighth root of what? 226.34. This will give us the same thing as log 226.34 raised to power what? 1 all over 8 is the same thing. We should now give because this root, this eight root, when we call it 1 all over 8, then the 1 all over 8 will bring it to the front. We should now give us 1 all over 8 log 226.34, which goes to 1 all over 8 in bracket, what is the law? Law, what is log 226.34? And I'll say log 226.34 equals to 2.35476.1312, which equals to 1 times this will give us 2.35476.1312 divided by 8. Divided by 8 equals to, equals to 0 0.2943 This is what we have here. Equals to 0 0.29 in this, this, this. Then we now say final answer equals to 10 raised to power 0 0.2943. 4, 5, 1, 6, 3, which our final answer equals to 10 raised to power is 0 0.2943 4, Our final answer equals to 1, 9, 6, Nine four five zero nine two three. This is our final answer. We move on to example five. Example five says that Example 5 here, AG5 says, if 460 in bracket 1.08 bracket close gets to power n equals to 925, comma, what is, what is n? To look for n here, we first bring out the, let's bring down the question. We say 460, 460 in bracket 1.08 raised to power n equals to 925. Equals to 925. The first thing we want to do here, what we are trying to do here is to make n the subject of the formula. If you want to use n here, the first thing is to divide both sides by 460. 
When you divide both sides by 460, you now say divide both sides by 460. Divide both sides by 460. 460 divided by 460. 460 by 1.08 divided by 460. Equals to 925 divided by 460. 460 cancel 460. We have in bracket 1.08 raised to power n equals to 925 divided by 460. 925 divided by 460 equals to 2.010 is 5. Now, we have this. In this place now, n, let's write this. This one will give us n log, what is there? 1.08 equals to log 2.010869565. Now, n that is here, we divide both sides again by this. Dividing both sides by this, what do we have? We want to make n the subject of the formula. Making n the subject of the formula, we have n equals to log 2.010869565 divided by log 1.08 1.08 which n equals to what is log you now look for log 2.010 equals to is equal point three zero three three eight Degree nine zero one divided by divided by log one point zero eight log one point zero eight so log one point zero eight will give us is zero point zero three three four two three three four two three seven five five and equals to this divided by this will give us our n. So we now say 0 0.3033 for 2 divided by 0.0335. Our final sum. We give us 9.07, 9.07, 6, 8, 9, 7, 6, 8, 9, 6, 8, 9, 4, 5, 9, 2. This is our final answer. We can now proceed to example 6. Example 6 says that far evaluate. Example 6 says, evaluate, evaluate 56,200 divided by 3484 using logs. Now, evaluate 56,200 divided by 3484 using log solution. We now say log fifty six thousand two hundred 
56,200 divided by log 3484. Now we move to this place. What we love, 56,200, give us. We now want to solve for that. Let's say log 5, 6, 200 equals to log 56,200 will give us 4.7497367366316 736 316 then log 3484 equals to log 3484 equals to 3.542078146. Now, we can now say log 10, the answer we have here, 4.74972. Is the division sign, it will now change to minus the log of this of 3484, which is what? 3.542078146. Now, then, now we now have 10, let's power this minus this. Minus. That what do we have? We have one point two zero, one point two zero, seven six, five eight, one seven, which our financial equals to ten raised to power one point. Then raised to power one point two zero seven six five eight one seven. Our final answer will give us sixteen point one three zero eight eight four zero seven. That is our final answer for example six. Our final answer is sixteen point one three zero eight eight four zero. Seven. We move on with our okay. I need something to clean it well. Now Let's look at some exponential question. For instance, in exponential logarithm conversion, log 10 equals to 1, log 100 equals to 2, log 1000 equals 3. How is it like that? Let me pick one as an example, log 100. Log 100 equals to log 10, this is normal in base 10, so 100 will give us 10 raised to power 2, which you now got this 2 coming will now be 2, log 10, 10, 10 cancel 10, our final answer is 2. The same thing is applicable to this, and this also 2. Now, let's move on to EG7. In EG7, we have Change the following logarithm to their equivalent exponential, equivalent exponential forms. 7, example 7a, log 8, 
verse 64. I'm sorry, log verse 8, 64. We give us log 8, 64. What can I multiply to get 64? 8 times 8. 8 is power 2. These two come here to be 2 log 8, 8. 8 can't sweet. I find answer will be 2. B, we have log base 5, 125. This will give us log base 5, 25. We have 5. Let's try what? 5 times 3, 25. 25 times 3, 125. This come here to be 3 log 5, 5. 5 cancel 5, 5. Our final answer will be 3. We move on. In our solving, for instance, if you have to solve C log base 7, 1 all over 7. How do you solve log base 7, 1 all over 7? Log base 7, 1 all over 7 means log base 7. This 1 all over 7 is the same thing as 7 raised to power minus 1. Which, this one will come to minus 1. Log 7, 7, 7 can 7, our final answer will give you negative 1. In D, we have question like log 4, log base 4, 32. Yes, this is one of the questions that will convince us a lot. Log base 4, 32, how do we solve this? You say, let log base 4, log base 4, 32 equals y. Log base 4, 32, you equals it to be what? To be y. Now, log base 4, 32 equals what? Y. This is 4. 4 is power y equals to what? 32. Then, if 4 is power y equals to 32, this 4, we have 2 raised to power 2 y equals to 2 raised to the power 5 here. 2 raised to the power 5 is the same as 32. That means 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. In fact, this is to give it 32. 2 cancel 2. Then we now have 2 times y. 2y equals to 5. Therefore, y equals to, if we divide both sides by 2, 2 cancel here, then we have 5 all over 2. That is our answer for that. In E, As we say, log 36 of 6. In answer, let log base 36 6 equals to y. Base 36 equals to y. That means 36 6 power y equals to, what is it? 6. Then, this 36, that will give us 6 raised to power 2 in bracket y equals to 6 raised to power 1. This cancel this, we now have 2 times y, 2y equals to 1. Divide both sides. Divide both sides by 2. 2y all over 2 equals to 1 all over 2. 2 cancel 2, y equals to 1 all over 2. That's uh, the answer to that. So, this is where we will start for this class.